it is a very hush hush you know like this topic of conversation so it should actually be normalized where people you know like have education on sex and they know what are the you know like the hygiene and health conditions related to it i think that should be talked about so, you know like the pros and cons of having sex at a young age should actually be understood by the teens and likewise they can take decisions whether you know like 16 is the right age or 18 is the right age in cases of pregnancy how is a 16 year old who is a child herself supposed to handle the responsibility of having another child i don't think that is that in any way is right and there there are medical uh, you know medical restrictions as well that a 16 year old might not be able to confer to and and then then comes society we all say that we have gone way beyond what the society expects us to do but we haven't i think that before like discussing the idea of age of consent the social context of india should be taken into consideration uh, obviously in western countries the age of con- consent uh, is lower it's not 18 it's 16 as low as 13 even but um, here in this context in in the indian social context it is important to understand uh, the idea of consent itself which is uh, which is like a, a an idea that is not that has not been discussed enough so yeah the idea of consent not being just a momentary yes or no kind of a idea but actually it being a constant process of reaffirmation that goes on throughout this this kind of education is not available to the marginalized communities of india sex as a topic has always been tabooed uh, over in india like there has there is no proper structure of sex education in our country so to discuss the age of consent first i think the need of proper sex education is important the need for education on what consent is important actually i i think it's a various debatable issue and i think we should concern about uh, that the age 16 is uh, not that much is to conceive a woman conceive for a woman because it's uh, also harmful for their health not only for the girl not only for the women but also for the child who will be born in their home uh, mujhe lagta hai ki 18 should be the legal age because before 18 women cannot be that much mature or a boy cannot be that much mature so they cannot take the decision to have a physical relationship or otherwise there can be many con- consequences so 18 should be the legal age the dynamic process of consent i think all this should be considered and talked about because uh, sexual violence is really common among indian women especially of young age and it's very easy to manipulate indian youth especially because of the kind of sex education or the lack of it that they get sex has been dealt dealt with taboo especially coming from older people older people of family who the youngsters rely on for information for vital information regarding their own sexuality and personal choices i think uh, from that point there is a lot of taboo that goes in there is a lot of fad misinformation that goes in and i think that makes it very difficult to have a proper sexual education and if a person doesn't have a proper sexual education have doesn't have a proper idea of consent i don't think the age of consent debate will be of much use i think hey, yes it's a growing age 16 should be the age of consent but that is pointless and that opens women up to much more uh, uh, violence and much more sexual instances of sexual assault if that is not com- complemented with positive governmental action right like sex education like uh, proper uh, sexual hygiene ed- education about sexual hygiene and in marginalized communities there should be ensured that if there is a case of sexual assault it should be judged not by the influence of the man's family not by the influence of caste or class but but by the victim's narrative but by the by the survivor's narrative